22 percent uh, of uh, all greenhouse gases come from the agricultural forest and land use sector and this is huge uh, that means it's the second biggest source of greenhouse gases and a lot of that is coming of course from uh, methane from paddy use from emissions from livestock from forest clearance for agricultural use so it's a huge source of emissions, but at the same time, it's also a huge potential for storing carbon, for, for sequestering carbon in soils and in trees. Uh, and at the same time, we have a very good opportunity for improving our food systems to reduce the level of waste. Food loss and waste is a huge source uh, of emissions, and better practices in our food systems could resolve the double problem that we have of both eliminating hunger and at the same time reducing our impact on the environment in producing that food. Uh, the report highlights the fact that land degradation uh, is affecting almost one quarter of the ice-free surface of the planet at this stage. And degraded land is both a source of emissions in this degradation process, but also it removes land from potential production. And we need that productivity to feed the world and to help reduce poverty. So restoring land, uh, restoring ecosystems, restoring biodiversity has to be one of our key tasks and there will be the beginning of a global decade of ecosystem restoration starting next year.